Welcome to Snow Riders, home of West Virginia's newest snow tubing attraction. Thank you for choosing us for your next adventure. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to ask a Snow Riders staff member. There is no alcohol or drugs permitted before or during your snow tubing session. You must be 36 inches or taller to snow tube, and parents are responsible for their children at all times. It is your responsibility to understand the waiver and all snow riders rules. There is risk involved with snow tubing. By tubing with us today, you are assuming all risks that are associated. Common sense and personal awareness will help reduce these risks. It is important to dress appropriately. Headphones and earbuds are not allowed while snow tubing. Please secure all loose items and leave backpacks and strollers behind. Please be sure to have your pass visible and ready at all times. It is necessary to have a valid pass while snow tubing. You will be issued a tube to use throughout your visit at Snow Riders. These tubes are the only things permitted on our snow tubing hill. No outside tubes, sleds, snowboards, or skis are allowed. You are responsible for maintaining control of your tube. Tubes must be returned at the end of your session at the bottom of the hill. When boarding the magic carpet, hold the tube leash firmly and pull the tube behind you onto the lift. Only load once the person in front of you reaches the load indicator sign. This ensures a distance of six feet between each guest. It is important to not walk or sit. If you happen to drop something while on the magic carpet, let the attendant at the top of the lift know. Please do not reach or step off of the lift as this can cause injury. If unsure of your ability to load, ride, or unload the magic carpet safely, please ask a Snow Rider staff member for instruction. Once you reach the top of the lift, please exit to the right and make your way to an open lane. Do not use a lane if it is marked closed. Listen to all instructions presented by Snow Rider staff. Please remain standing and wait until you have been instructed to move forward to the top of the lane. When it is your turn, tuck the tube leash in, sit with your bottom down into the tube, and hang your feet over the side of the tube facing downhill. There is only one person allowed per tube. It is to the discretion of Snow Rider staff if linking tubes is allowed with current conditions. Occasionally, a red light green light system will be used. When the light is green, you are good to tube. When the light is red, there is no tubing allowed. When this system is not in effect, you are only allowed to tube when the lane is fully cleared. If you are unsure of the system, please ask staff for instruction. Once you get to the bottom, quickly get up, stay in your lane, and walk towards the bottom hill attendants. Once you have cleared the lane, make your way to the right towards the magic carpet. Always keep your eye uphill for incoming tubers. If you happen to fall off your tube while on the hill, please get up and carefully walk down the rest of the way towards the bottom of the hill while staying in your lane. If you happen to drop something while tubing, please let the attendant at the bottom of the hill know so they may retrieve it. If you have a collision with another tubing guest resulting in injury, it is your responsibility to exchange information with the other party involved and to report it to a staff member. Please be sure to observe all signs and warnings and listen to any additional information from Snow Rider staff. If at any time you are found not abiding by Snow Rider's rules, you will be asked to leave without a refund. Snow tubing can be great fun as long as it's done safely. Thank you for visiting Snow Riders. We hope you have a great time and we hope to see you again soon.